Hello, let us discuss about neutrinos. Neutrinos are subatomic particles. Neutrinos are very tiny, almost weightless particle. Khub choto hai, either mass almost equal to 0. Now, what about their interaction? Neutrinos only interacted by gravity and nuclear decay. Gravity or nuclear decay uh, khetrei, either interaction ta dekhte bawaj hai. For light, they do not interact with electromagnetic radiation. Mane light e shathe re uh, interact kore na. Tai, neutrino ka chhe light ta ho chhe alien. So, we can't see neutrino. We just can't see it with the help of light. Let us talk about its detection. Particle jokho na chhe, tokhon we need to catch them. Ama ke detect kurta hai particle ta in order to know its properties. But detection of neutrinos is very hard. It's like catching a bullet with a butterfly neck. It is not possible, indeed. Even a neutrino can pass through a block of lead. Up to two years it can travel before stopping. Leader act a block in Monte the neutrino jokon travel corre stop corner age she a blocked in Monte two years travel corre. Whereas, in case of nuclear radiation coming out of the bombs, nuclear bombs, those radiations can be stopped by a lead block of width just 10 centimeter. So, how to detect this uh, tiny? weightless particles, almost weightless particles. Now, we know that light when passes through water, it gets slows down. Light jokhon water er mundhe diye pass kore, tokhon slow down hoye jay. If we throw a neutrino through water, it will turn into, it will give into electron by ionizing the water molecules. And these electrons will in turn polarize the atoms and molecules of water when it passes along. When it passes the electron to water molecule, it passes the J molecule to pass the O chole jabe, she molecule to polarize the water. If J electron to chole galo, shonge shonge molecule to our initial state of fire. If a process to show act a damped oscillation, act electromagnetic radiation near Gothohoi. This kind of radiation is called Cherenkov radiation. So, because of the polarization done by the electron, which is a charged particle, polarization is done by the electron to the water molecules or atoms. When the charged particle passes along, it polarizes the water molecules and when it passes after that the water molecules or atoms gets back to their initial condition. But by this process they emit electromagnetic waves with a continuous distribution of frequencies. So, in this way with the help of a big tank of water, we are able to determine neutrinos. This is the world's largest neutrino detector, which is a balloon situated at south pole of our earth and we are using the enormous mass of ice in the south pole. Because of the neutrinos, we came to know that the universe and its mirror image are not same. If we, if we change things from left to right, clockwise to anticlockwise, gravity, strong, strong nuclear force and for weak nuclear force, things do not change. But what is weird, Bakub Astor Jo Neutrino Jono, Sheta Hoche, they all are left handed and we do not have any mirror image for them. So, just for joking, 
neutrinos can be thought of as vampires of physics. If we look into uh, the things we encounter in our daily life that is trees, mountains, we are human beings and other objects and uh, animals, everything is the same. They do not change their identities. Trees remain the same. A baseball or a tennis ball is always a tennis ball. It does not matter that whether you uh, hit it with a racket or it just uh, flies on its own in the air. Like every physical object, mountains, sun, cat, dogs, beetles, even the subatomic particles like electrons, they remain electron whenever they are inside an atom or they are flying freely through interstellar space. Their mass remains the same, their charge remains the same. But we can't say this for neutrinos. These very tiny, almost massless, chargeless particles traveling very, very fast with almost equal to the speed of light, they change their identity depending on with which objects they are interacting with. Neutrino identity era ki dhoroner bostu shonge interact korche tar shathe shathe kintu change hoye jay. Moreover, when they are flying freely in space, even then their identities change depending on how they interact with other particles like when they are coming out of the sun because of the fusion reaction and when they are coming out of a nucleus in case of nuclear decay, they are ident they interact differently with other particles and based on how they are behaving in case of interaction with other particles, their identities are labeled like this. They are classified as electron neutrino, muon neutrino and tau neutrino. These identities depend on the particles involved in their creation. Moreover, when the neutrinos are traveling, their identities even change. In traveling in free, free space, their identities are labeled as say nu1, nu2, nu3. All these are having different, different masses and there is no correspondence that is, there is no one to one matching between these identities. So, we have also seen that each identity here that is electron neutrino, muon neutrino and a tau neutrino, these identities are actually a very unique combination of all the three traveling identities. That means, we will get this by a unique mixture of this, this and this. Again, we will get mu 1 neutrino by a, another unique mixture of nu 1, nu 2, nu 3. Karma ne, tara jakhon nijedesh shathe ake aporesh shathe interact korche, তখন তাদের আইডেন্টিটি গুলোকে আমরা বলছি ইলেকট্রন নিউট্রিনো মিউ1 নিউট্রিনো টাউ নিউট্রিনো তারা যখন স্পেসে ট্রাভেল করছে তখন তাদেরকে আমি বলছি নিউ1 নিউ2 নিউ3 নিউ1 নিউ2 নিউ3 এর কিন্তু মাস বা ভরগুলো डिफरेंट डिफरेंट এবং ইলেকট্রন নিউট্রিনো আর নিউ1 এর মধ্যে কিন্তু কোনো করেসপন্ডেন্স নেই কোনো ম্যাচিং নেই সিমিলারলি মিউ1 নিউট্রিনো আর uh, traveling neutrino mudhe nu, uh, neutrino 2 jeta tadero kono correspondence ba matching nei ebong tau neutrino er khetro bapar ta shotti ashole ei electron neutrino mu1 neutrino ebong tau neutrino hocche nu1 nu uh, mu, uh, nu1 nu2 and nu3 er ekta kore unique mixture ba combination so the interacting variants of neutrino which is electron neutrino, muon neutrino and tau neutrino 
they are the linear combinations or the superposition of all the three traveling variants just want to uh, separate one traveling neutrino from the other we have uh, designated this arrow for this one and this arrow for this one and this up arrow for this one so each electron neutrino mu1 neutrino and tau neutrino they are unique combinations of this but this is not constant if we observe an electron neutrino over time then we will see that this electron neutrino will have this kind of configurations that means it is now tau neutrino similarly the switch between i mean the switch among themselves they change their identity so neutrinos can change their identities and there is always a switching of identities between themselves man electron neutrino theke mu1 neutrino and vice versa mu1 neutrino theke tau neutrino and vice versa and of course electron neutrino theke tau neutrino and vice versa now all this uh, traveling components of neutrinos new one new to new three they are having different different masses ebar jehetu tader masses are different that means they travel in space with different types of uh, profile i mean with different types of velocities mass jodi different hoy naturally tader velocity o different different hobe so they are traveling corresponds to a complex phase phase depending on their masses so the this combination changes with uh, time as these are the superpositions onto itself producing the different types of neutrinos for example what we have discussed just now is suppose we want to watch over take a watch on this um, electron neutrino ke electron neutrino ke observe korchi as the time progresses we will see that the electron neutrino will become like this so it will now a tau neutrino similarly if we watch it over even uh, for even more time tale tau neutrino ta ke amra dekhbo abar electron neutrino hoye geche this is because uh, that uh, these uh, neutrinos they are very very super fast i mean they are traveling almost with the speed of light in space sorry about the light this situation is analogous to this thing suppose i am playing a guitar ami ekta guitar bajacchi according to the position of the observer this sound the original sound of the guitar which we call s may differ to the first observer he may listen it as s1 similarly for the second and third observer it may appear as s2 and s3 because s have experienced a shifting in its frequency তাহলে ডিপেন্ডিং অন দ্য পজিশন অফ দ্য লিসেনার শ্রোতা কোথায় দাঁড়িয়ে আছে তার ওপর ডিপেন্ড করে অরিজিনাল যে গিটার থেকে নির্গত যে সাউন্ডটা এস সেটার ফ্রিকুয়েন্সি চেঞ্জ করার দরুন তিনজন অবজারভারের কাছে এটি ডিফারেন্ট ডিফারেন্ট হবে শোনা যাবে কারোর কাছে এস ওয়ান কারোর কাছে এস টু কারোর কাছে এস থ্রি হিসাবে শোনা যাবে দিস ইজ ভেরি ইম্পর্টেন্ট অ্যান্ড দিস ইজ Uh, called the neutrino oscillation which is just switching over between its own identities mane neutrino ta je nijer identity gulor moddhe switch over korche ekbar she electron neutrino ekbar she mu1 neutrino ekbar she tau neutrino sorry this is over time this is called a uh, neutrino oscillation ebong this is a a very good uh, reason to explain i mean this uh, oscillation of neutrino back and forth back and forth we are able now to explain 
this thing that uh, as the uh, theory of fusion suggests within the sun more number of electron neutrinos must come on earth so that we could get a lots and lots of electron neutrinos but two third of them because of this switching between its own identities which is termed as neutrino oscillation these electron neutrinos are now muon neutrino and tau neutrino mane theory of fusion er suggestion onujayi sun er bhetore je fusion hocche tate joto poriman electron neutrino paoa uchit chilo toto gulo amra prithibir opore detect korte pari na keno pari na tar karon hocche ei back and forth switch between its own identity of neutrino ei karone neutrino ta nijer identity je constantly change kore jacche with time tar phole almost दुई तृतीयांश इलेक्ट्रन निउट्रिनो आर्थे डिटेक्ट हार आगे मिओन और टाउ निउट्रिनोते रूपान्तरित तो हो जाए दिस इज अ भेरि गुड एक्साम्पल अफ रियल एंड लंग रेज क्वान्टम सुपार पजिशन दिस इज अ भेरि गुड आई मिन दिस इज अ भेरि रियल एक्साम्पल अफ क्वान्टम सुपार पजिशन द लास्ट थिंग अबाउट निउट्रिनो नट द लिस्ट अफकोर्स we have just seen that it can switch its identities between themselves though they have got their names from the particles involved in their creation they can switch over within the family so this thing is possible this thing is also possible switching over between this and this is possible switching over between this and this is possible and of course they can bounce off the quarks also thanks very much for watching